Welcome to my Jamaican uh, cooking channel. Today I'm going to show you how I make the sorrel. In this cup, there is uh, there's one cup of um, of rice. Now some people wonder about that, but I'll explain that to you later. And you need um, some Jamaican um, pimento seeds. Of course, you need ginger. And I always use a little um, cinnamon leaf, cinnamon sticks. And if you have, um, you know, you can buy these actually. You can buy cinnamon sticks online or any Korean store here in New York. Because I'm in New York. But in America, wherever you live, you just find a Korean store. They most likely might have it. And I use these, this pack of sorrel. Now, if I was in Jamaica, I would not be using this. But sorrel is very, if you see the fresh sorrel here, it's very expensive. But I found that these work well also. So I have, I'm going to use, today I'm going to use two packs of sorrel of this one. And this is a four and a half ounce. Now I generally don't use much of any measurement. But, um, you know, just so you get an idea of what. And I also have, um, it's, it, this is optional. But I like to put some nutmeg maize in it. Not the nutmeg, just the maize. Alright, and um, I already have some um, in the pot cooking. I already started that and it's cooking. And as I said, two packs of the sorrel and all the other accoutrements that I mentioned before. And it's, it's being cooked and I cooked this for about half an hour. Um, you know, with the ginger, you know, crushed ginger and everything in it. All right, um, let me just show you. I generally do my ginger in the food processor, but if you don't have a food processor, if you don't, if you don't have a food processor, you can just grate it or, you know, I don't know. Um, with the food processor, I, what I like about using the food processor is that you don't have to put water in it. So you don't water down everything. You're doing coconut, you don't have to water it down. All you have to do is just put it in there and crush it, crush it to, the, you know, to whatever dimension you want. And um, so that's, that's, that's um, the total. So you are going to boil it in the pot. And um, you boil it uh, uh, for about half an hour. I always, you put the rice and everything in it. Let me just put this rice in because I didn't put rice in yet. So I'll just put the rice in, the cup of rice. And you put the rice so it gives you a little, it's not the taste, it's about the backup, the backup, well, it's the backup taste that you get. It's not just pure sweet and ginger. You get another little body in your, um, in your sorrel. Um, you could try both. Try it without the rice, try it with the rice, and you make it cook. Because, you know, people use rice to make wine. They have rice wine. So, let it cook and leave. I leave it there sometime for a day or all long. You know, today's Wednesday, Sunday is Christmas, and I'm making it today. So, I bottle, you know, so after I make them, make it, cool it, sweeten, sweeten to taste. I'm not going to say how much sugar, just put some sugar, taste until you get, you know, what you want. For those people that are diabetic, you could also use um, Splenda. Splenda, you know, um, works with, um, it tastes much better to me. Well, you don't have that bad taste like other sweeteners. Also, most of the other sweeteners, when you, when you use them in anything hot, it, it, you know, it null the taste. There's no sugar taste or anything. So it doesn't taste like it has sugar. Anyway, I'm not talking about sweeteners. I'm talking about, sorry. All right. So, um. So now I'm going to show you my glass that I already fill with sorrel. And this will be great for your dinner table. Here it is. Jamaican sorrel. Ready made for you. Okay. If you have, I'm going to put links at the bottom here to some of this stuff on Amazon. If you want, you can, you know, go there and order if you can't get them. But everything, fresh things are always the best. If you can get real, not cinnamon powder. I don't use cinnamon powder. I like to use real cinnamon sticks. Or, you know, even the rolled up one is good. All right, so that's it for today. Please subscribe to my channel. Like, ask any questions. 
and I'll answer them and check out my other videos. I'll soon be uploading the rum cake video. Thanks for watching. Subscribe. Thank you.